The man suspected in the killing of a UC Davis graduate in Russia appeared in court today. Alexander Popov is accused of stabbing 34-year-old Catherine Saru to death. His attorney says he admitted his guilt. Her body was found yesterday in a wooded area. She had been missing since Tuesday. Officials say the suspect gave her a ride in his car. Saru moved to Russia back in 27, uh, 2019 rather, to study law. And today we spoke to one of her professors at UC Davis about how she will be remembered. Catherine was just a lovely person inside and out. She immediately stood out in the class for her intelligence, for her uh, articulateness, for her passion for the subject matter. She's one of those students whose passion feeds your own passion as an instructor. If I had had to choose a student to be an unofficial ambassador for everything that is positive about UC Davis students, just the, the intelligence, the openness, the friendliness, the warmth, you know, Catherine would have been at the top of that list. Jenny Kaminer also spoke on the pervasiveness of violence against women and that students should not be afraid to go to Russia because of this incident. Unfortunately, violence against women is not something that is unique to any country or to any national tradition. And I would absolutely continue to counsel students and encourage them to immerse themselves in Russia, in the Russian culture. If anyone possessed the requisite personal qualities to be able to handle themselves abroad, it was Catherine, which adds an entire new level of, of tragedy and poignancy, I think, to, to what happened to her. Before Catherine's disappearance, her mother said Catherine sent her a text saying that she was in a car with a stranger. Investigators have not revealed the circumstances around Catherine getting into that car.